Ralph, the first suspect I'm going to talk about in this roundup of arrests here in Catawba County faces drug and traffic charges. 26-year-old Nang Vang of Oak Ridge Church Street in Connolly Springs was arrested by Longview police officers. He's charged with felony possession of Schedule II controlled substance, maintaining a vehicle dwelling or place to keep controlled substance, two counts of possession of marijuana, possession of drug paraphernalia, failure to appear on account of possession of methamphetamine, and flee to elude arrest with a motor vehicle. Vang also faces additional traffic violations. He was placed in the Catawba County Detention Facility Tuesday morning under $45,000 bond. He remained there as of earlier today. His next district court date is July 18th. 21-year-old Bailey Colleen Presnell of Blackberry Road, Lenore, was arrested by Longview police officers. She's charged with possession with intent to manufacture, sell, and deliver Schedule II controlled substance, possession with intent to sell and deliver marijuana, and possession of drug paraphernalia. Presnell was placed in the Catawba County Detention Facility Tuesday morning under $20,000 bond. She remained in jail as of earlier today. A district court date is set for July 31st. 31-year-old Sammy Allen Moody Jr. of Silver Creek Church Road in Morganton was arrested Tuesday by Hickory police officers. He's charged with one felony count each of possession of a stolen firearm and possession of a firearm by a felon. He was arrested after police found a stolen firearm during a call for service at a hotel on 13th Avenue Drive Southeast in Hickory. Moody was arrested without incident and placed in the Catawba County Detention Facility with bonds set at $20,000 secured. He remained in jail as of earlier today. A district court date is August 1st. 26-year-old Sabrina Autumn Belcher of 3rd Avenue Northeast in Conover was arrested Tuesday by Catawba County Sheriff's officers. She's charged with possession with intent to manufacture, sell, and deliver methamphetamine and possession of drug paraphernalia. Belcher's bond was set at $2,500. She was no longer listed as an inmate. A superior court date was scheduled for yesterday. Reporting from Catawba County for WHKY-TV News, I'm Rob Eastwood. Back to you, Ralph.